Well, there's no excuse for this. Let's begin. Now, of course, you may have seen a video that I put out yesterday about Sainsbury's. And in that video, I said that apparently it's come out that supermarkets have been overcharged us six pence per litre. But of course, Tesco's has apparently taken that one step further and said, hold my beer. The article says that a Tesco filling station is selling petrol for 15 pence more than 140 miles away. The store at Blandford Forum in Dorset had unleaded 154.9p a litre on Sunday, but it was 139.9 pence at Andover. And it came just as competition watchdogs accused supermarkets of fleecing drivers for nearly £1 billion last year by charging an extra six pence a litre too much. Tesco's insisted though it welcomed the competition and markets authorities called for greater transparency and the setting up of a pump watch app scheme to monitor prices. It added, we regularly monitor fuel prices at a local and national level to make sure we're giving our customers competitive prices. By yesterday though, the price at Blandford Forum had dropped to 146.9 pence a litre, but still 7 pence dearer than at Andover. Meanwhile, the Sainsbury's CEO, Simon Roberts, also backed the app idea. He said his chain had 4% of petrol stations, but so 10% of the UK's fuel because it was often cheaper than its rivals. He added, we will always be the cheapest or second cheapest in any location. Harriet Baldwin, chair of the Treasury Select Committee yesterday, accused retailers of not passing on the 5p cut in fuel duty, echoing the decade-long keep it down campaign on behalf of our readers, said The Sun. Well, correct me if I'm wrong, but Tesco does seem to like to appear to be the company that helps out people with things like club card prices, presumably to make you think that they're doing all they can to keep their prices down. So something like this, where they charge people in one area quite a bit less than people only 40 minutes away, surely goes against all that, doesn't it? And whilst admittedly I can't speak for all drivers out there, I would just like to say to them, Read between the lines, Tesco. And yes, obviously, petrol prices can vary at different locations around the country. We know that, but surely not one 40 minutes away from the other one by as much as 15p. I mean, you could obviously understand the difference between, I don't know, 3 or 5 pence at the very most, but 15 pence per litre. That's going to surely add up, isn't it? In the middle of a cost of living crisis, when let's face it, Tesco and nearly every other supermarket out there seems to be rising their prices quicker. The lies seem to have come out of Matt Hedcock's mouth during the pandemic. But anyway, Tesco's founder always said price them low and stack them high, which was surely was their philosophy going forward and actually helped out quite a lot of people. So you would have liked to have thought that they would have carried this through to their fuel and through bar phones and whatever else they tend to do. But if anything, all this does for me is to make me wonder, I wonder what Asda prices are. Anyway, I'll be back soon, so make sure you click that subscribe button down there so you don't miss my next video. I'll see you in the next one.